So today we'll learn about the contour, contour interval, define types of landform based on uh, steep and gentle slope, triangulated height, spot height, benchmark, relative height and depth. So what is a topographical map? So in this, I will highlight few points. So a topographical map is a large scale map. This is first po important point. It should be there in your answer which combine natural features and man-made features on a single sheet with the help of colors and conventional symbols. So, this much you have to write. And the man-made features are so-and-so and natural features are so-and-so. If you wish, you can write to make your answer more perfect. Who produced topographical map in India? Topographical map in India are produced by Survey of India. Survey of India is the national survey and mapping organization. Then you must say that which involved in surveying, mapping and map reproduction. Now let's look at another question which is very common. What is contour or defined contour? Contours are imaginary line that join the places having, so next join the places having the same height and above sea level and it's in meters. So this, all these points are very important. One is that imaginary line, then you are saying then having the same height and then it is from the sea level and it is in meters, which are? These are all these lines are, these are contour lines, okay. They are shown in brown color. If you can add this, this will make your answer more perfect. What is the contour interval in the survey of India map? You remember always it is 20 meters. So it is contour intervals are drawn at a contours are drawn at an interval of just 20 meters. Okay, that is the difference between two successive contours. What is an index contour? So index contour is shown with a bold color, brown color, and it is an interval of 100 meters. So we can see, see if it is 300, so here this 300 contour is going, and this is 400. So these are, there are, like we can see one, two, three, four, and then fifth. So there are 100 meter difference between two uh, index contour line. How to identify steep slope and gentle slope? In this place, we can see that these area, they are, they are very, very spaced apart. So the spaced apart. So this is a gentle slope. But in this area, you can see they are very closely spaced. When they are closely spaced, they are steep slope. So this is the difference between steep and gentle. What is the difference between 280 written in brown and 280 written in black? So where are those? This is 280 written in black and this is 280 written in brown. So we know that as this is a brown, one so this is a contour right this is a contour so 280 written in brown is the height of the contour line which is measured from the sea level but now let's look at 280 at the bottom 280 written in black is the spot height which has been measured from the sea level they are taken randomly to help survey a person to see the height of different places so this is um, the meaning. Now, what is the meaning of the triangle with 217 and what is the meaning of the spot with 222? So the, here is a triangle. So this is the triangle. And this is the spot, 222. So a triangle with 217 means trigonometrical or triangulated height, which is shown with a small triangle. So you first, it should be your first point in your answer. And distance are surveyed by an angular measurement and ground distance calculated by using trigonometry. This will be your second point. This is third point you can take or it is up to you. A theodolite is used for angular measurement. Theodolite is a survey instrument. 
the height is measured in meters and measured from sea level. This is most important. You must write that too with that triangulated height. Next is spot height shows uh, the height of a point above sea level and it is in meters. For this also it is very important. This is from sea level and in meters to study the relief feature between contour lines. What is the significance of 285 with a black symbol? So where is that 285 with a black symbol? Here it is. So what is the meaning of that? 285 with a black symbol is a prominent survey tree. So those that tree we can see black color tree. It is called survey tree. What is survey tree in a village? Uh, an old tree such as banyan tree or mango tree can be uh, become an important landmark what survey do. It is shown as black tree with a height written to next. So this is actually the height of this place and uh, this height is shown from the sea level and the height is written on a steel plate marked on the trunk of the tree. You remember that this is also this height is shown with this is also in meter. Next is what is the significance of BM224.6? Where is benchmark? This is called benchmark. So this is BM stands for benchmark. So your first point you have to write this. The height is measured in meters from sea level. This is very important. You must write it is in meters and it is from sea level. The height BM224.6 is written on the permanent structure. Might be it is on the side of a building or maybe on a rock cliff. They write that number. What does 225R and 6R mean? So where are those? So here is 6R we can see here. And this is 25R, here is that. So what is mean? This is first point is, this is relative height. First you have to mention whether it is relative height or relative depth is indicated by the symbol R. And six are written next to river bank. So as it is written just next to here is the river bank. So next to river bank. So it is the height of the river bank from the bottom to the top of the river bank. The height is measured in meters and measured from the adjacent ground, not sea level. This is very, very important because previously, whatever we have learned, those are all from sea level. This is not from sea level, from the surrounding ground. Next is then 25R written in blue. So it is when it is blue, it is depth. When it is black, it is height shows the relative depth of the lined perennial well. So we have to mention that what is the feature you are taking. You can see that what, what depth of what feature they are showing the depth. In meters, and this is also very important, it is uh, measured in meters and it is measured from the adjacent ground to not sea level. 